New at 5:30. She looks like a normal, happy, playful puppy until you take a closer look. This boxer is missing one of her hind legs. She had to have it amputated after being brutally attacked. Ross Kadati has more on why police say they didn't have to go far to figure out who did it. This here is eight month old Emily. She is a boxer pup. She got a lot of spunk and spirit. She is, however, missing one thing, and that is a leg. A leg that was taken after what her owner says was an act of absolute cruelty. Her stub tail moving like the prop on a motorboat. This busy baby boxer named Emily loves and trusts people. That's what makes what happened to the dog so shocking. And what Mary Gannon and at least one witness say, nephew Zach Gannon, did to the creature. She got excited on the porch where he was at and she peed on his foot. Enraged, the 21 year old allegedly kicked the dog firmly in its hind leg. Not home at the time, Mrs. Gannon says she saw Emily limping about, and the normally sweet dog wouldn't let anyone get near her. And whenever you went to go and touch her, she would yelp and try, you know, nipping at you. It would, however, become clear what happened to the dog's hind leg. He broke it. At first, Zach Gannon denied it, but then Mrs. Gannon says she got a text. This is the reason why your dog has three legs, because of me. State police cited Zach Gannon charging him with cruelty to animals. Mary Gannon says what Emily did is what all puppies do. But in her opinion, what her nephew supposedly did can be summed up in only two words. Very evil. Now, Emily here with Grandma Abby here by her side is expected to do just fine. As for Zach Gannon, he is probably going to face significant fines. Grateful. Ross Gadotti. KDK TV News.